Hey, 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 welcome back to My Baby Experts. Hi, everyone. Good evening, TGIF. It's Friday and it's Amazon Live. And we are here to party and have some awesome deals to shop. Who's ready for some shopping? I am ready. All right, you guys ready? The only thing I'm not ready with is I don't have a drink, and that's going to be a problem because I'm going to get thirsty. So, Kaylee, would you mind texting Joe and letting him know that I need a drink, okay? Because I don't have anything here, and my throat is going to be dry. I could tell. I could tell. So welcome back to My Baby Experts. I'm Sherry, and we are here for amazing weekend deals here on Amazon, and I hope you guys are all ready for some fun things. Um, we're going to send out a notification and get the crew in here to uh, – let everyone know that we are live and we are ready for another evening. Okay, so we'll send that out and get everybody to jump in with us. And there we go. Hi, Brandy. You're always around. Brandy, what are you doing? Are you living here, Brandy? <laughs> I love it. I love it. Facebook just notified. Isn't that great? Yeah, see, if we don't get you with the app and we don't get you with Amazon, we're going to get you with Facebook. We're going to get you with YouTube. We're going to get you somewhere, right? So that you guys know. I hope that's good. I hope you're happy about that. I am happy. Good to see you tonight. Good to see you tonight. Yeah, so I'm by myself tonight. We're going to just hang out. I'm standing up. Maybe I'll sit down. I'm not sure. But uh, we will. <laughs> it's like it's Friday, you know. Who's ready for the weekend? I feel like I just got back. We just got back from vacation. And it's kind of nice to come back midweek. You feel like that? Like you go on vacation and then you're like, Better to come back like on a Tuesday or a Wednesday. So you only have a couple of days of work before it's like, oh, I need a break again, right? Too much time off makes you want more time off. I don't know about you, but that is how I feel. Yes. Ah, uh, yes. There's our notification. Do you guys hear that? It just went off and everybody's going to know now. So we are going to get started. Um, let me start with the first thing here that I have in the carousel. This is an awesome product. This is a... Such a cute bomber jacket. And I owe Kaylee one of these. I know I owe Kaylee. She's nodding her head. <laughs> She's nodding her head. She's like, yes, you do. Yes, you do, ma'am. Um, and so this is from Zigu. Okay, this is a casual women's bomber jacket. Okay, I'm showing it to you here in the silver. All right, this is the silver. But it is super cute. Okay, here we go. It is a bomber jacket. I mean, just like it sounds. And I just think this is the cutest little jacket. It is satin. You can you, you can get it in different um, colors and fabrics. And let me go ahead and see if I can pop that on the screen for you here. It's a really high, it's a really nice jacket, okay? It's machine washable. It's got this nice zipper here so you can zip it up. You can zip it up to the collar. You can zip it open a little. It's got the nice elastic on the, on the, um, on the collar and it's got the nice elastic sleeves here. It's got the little zipper on the side. You can do a little hiding. You can put your money there. You can put your credit card there, whatever you want. Um, it's got pockets, and that's always a must. We love pockets here. Hold on. I can't see my chat. What is wrong? You know what? I'm on the wrong show. Hold on a second. Let me just get to the right place so I can see you because all of a sudden, there we go. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, and so it's just a super cute little jacket. Isn't this nice? And I wasn't sure how I was going to like this silver this silver, like um, satiny silver, but I'm actually really digging it. I don't know. What do you guys think? I think this is really cute. I usually go with something more simple, but I think like just a little bit of shine is that like, you know, kind of gives it that little extra, you know, it's definitely a casual jacket, um, but it feels a little dressier with the, uh, with the satin. Yeah, it's cute, right? Isn't this cute? Yeah, so it's on deal today. It's got a really good price. Thank you for my drink, Joe, yay. I was like, oh my God, I'm never going to make it through without drink. I'll order some more. Oh, thank you. All right. So see this? This is the theme for tonight. Okay. Too blessed to be stressed. Can I get an amen on that? Too blessed to be stressed. That's the truth, right? We, we, we stress so much, but the truth is we are too blessed. Too blessed to be stressed. I'm going to take a sip there. All right, so zipper closure, machine washable, comes in all the different colors and styles. You can even get it in like a um, like a pleated version as well. Um, you know, I think just a, a cute little jacket that can be worn casually or dressy. And I'm gonna just, let me go ahead and put up the, um, the different colors here so you can see it. I wanna pop this up here on the screen so you can see the prices on these. 
and also the different colors. Yes, it's cute. All right, so um, this one right here is, I think I'm wearing the one, where is it? Is it the, it's the silver. I can't tell now. Uh, I think it's the silver one over here, right? So then you got all the different colors. You've got it in black. You've got it in prints. You've got it in army green. Um, you've got dark gray, all these different colors here. Um, it's such a cute little windbreaker and bomber jacket. All right, $30.59. It's on deal for 24% off. So um, just a really nice, I, Bree said, I got you, you got me through YouTube this time. Is Ari loving that? Isn't that funny? Every, you can get it from all the different places now, right? All right, so this is the little Zigu women's casual jacket. And I feel like I want to leave it on. It's just so cute. And it's kind of cold down here. So I am going to leave it on. All right, so um, I'm just highlighting that in the carousel. If this is the first time that you are joining us here on Amazon Live, uh, everything that I'm going to review with you tonight, all the different cool stuff that I'm going to show you tonight is going to be highlighted here in the carousel. The carousel is the products below me or to the side of me, depends on how you're watching, if you're on your mobile device or if you are on a computer or your laptop or your tablet. All right. So they're somewhere around. You can either swipe up or look below us. And the one that's red and featured is the one that we're going over. If I remember to switch it, sometimes I forget. And then Kaylee remembers. And Kaylee's in the chat with us tonight. Everybody say hi to Kaylee. Hi, Kaylee. Everybody say hi. Okay, Kaylee is Kaylee is my assistant. Kaylee is in the chat. She is ready to answer questions for you here. And if you have any problems or any issues, you know, Kaylee's always there. Kaylee's, right? Is Kaylee not the best? She is. And she's always there. And there she is. In the chat. I can see her. You guys can't. This is the best thing. You know, it's like, it's, I love it this way, Kaylee. When I'm, when I'm streaming like this, I can actually see you now. So it's like you and I are, uh, she's nodding at me and I'm getting my like, positive reinforcement that someone's listening. So that's actually good. <laughs> yes. Hi, Kaylee. Everybody's saying hi to you. All right. Next up, let's move on to the next uh, product here. Oh, we've got these nice Satina leggings. Okay. I know who won the leggings the last time we gave these away. We gave these away a couple weeks ago and somebody won Satina leggings. And I know that you guys really, really like these. Um, they are the softest most comfortable. Where are they? Here we go. I've had, I got a couple different pairs here. Um, these are the ones with the pockets too, which I just love. And actually the ones I'm holding are, are I think the ones that I think my pocket ones are upstairs. The ones with the pockets. These are actually the, um, the Capri ones, but I believe they're all on deal today. So we've got um, the high-waisted leggings. We've got the Capri leggings, the ones with the pockets, um, all of them are on deal. And these are just buttery, soft leggings. Satina leggings are just, if you like, le who doesn't like leggings? Do you like leggings? Who likes to wear leggings? <laughs> I'm either wearing leggings or yoga pants or pajamas. <laughs> those, are my, those are my three go-tos, right? You work from home. That's the beauty of it all is that, you know, I could put on my makeup. I could put on something nice on the top, but from the waist down, I'm going to be comfortable. My sneakers, my, you know, if that's the way it goes. And, and who, why wouldn't we want to be comfortable? Yes. Uh, somebody received, a, I received my prize today in the big away yesterday. Yay. Congrats, Desiree. Congrats. Yes. Yeah. Kaylee says, I'm in pajama pants. Laura says, leggings are life live in leggings. That's, that's the truth. Live in leggings. I have my yoga pants on right now, actually. And they have the pockets in the back. I like literally have weeded through all of my yoga pants and gotten rid of anything that doesn't have pockets in the back because pockets on leggings or pockets on yoga pants are a must. I don't know. To me, they are. So let's get over to the picture here so you can see it a little bit better. Um, they do come in all different cool um, colors. Them. They're super nice. Again, buttery soft. When I say buttery soft, I mean like they're not going to like, they're not the kind of pan, like fabric that's going to pill or get like, you know, itchy or anything like that. They're just soft on your skin. It's the way you want it to feel like a second skin. All right. It's like a second skin on you. Super soft, um, elastic around the waist. Um, they stretch really, really nice. And, um, you know, just 
they're they're polyester and spandex you got a really nice stretch on that they wash really well too so they wash and um here's all the different colors you can look at all right 20 19 off at 15 dollars 29 you choose your size they do come in like a one size like a one size or a one size plus so you kind of look at their you just go ahead and look at the um at the sizing chart and decide which one you you need best and um it's going to be a pretty easy choice because you're only choosing between the two there so um and all these cute colors too and at that price um you can go ahead and pick up a few different pairs in different colors i mean that's what i do when i find something i really like i get it in like every color and I'm not kidding about that. Like, seriously, you guys have seen me. Sometimes I'm wearing a shirt and it has like the same style. And then you see me in it in a different color. Kaylee's nodding her head. She's like, yeah, you do do that. I'm like, yeah, when I like something, when I like it, I like it. And I don't care. I'm not ashamed about that. I do like it. I'm trying to raise my table up a little bit. Hold on one second. Why is this not going up? Give me one second, you guys. Okay, there we go. Ah, uh, All right, there we go. Now I can see better. When I like something, <laughs> it's like when I go to, re to a restaurant and I go to get something to eat. If I go to the same restaurant over and over, I'll just keep ordering the same thing at a particular restaurant. Because when I like it, I like it. That's it. But I've been married to the same person for as long as I have, right? When I like it, I like it. Here's some, here's, these are um, some other prints that you can do in the leggings as well. Again, all different styles different um, cuts of them, but the fabric are all the same in that same nice buttery fabric. All right. So, hi. Yes. Uh, just going to read the chat a little bit here. I love wearing comfy pants, Bree says. Who doesn't, right? And when you have kids and after you have kids, like, oh, I just want to be comfortable all the time. Um, the Jennifer says, these are really soft and nice. I wore, I want a pair from your stream. Yeah. Okay. Jennifer won them. Awesome. Yay. All right. <laughs> Hi, Carol. Hi, JC mom of three. Hello. Hello. All right. Next up, um, we actually have a something for men too. Okay. These are, and, and uh, Joel, Kaylee's husband was nice enough to demonstrate them for us. He did a very nice job on his uh, TikTok video here. Um, these are the, I don't know how to say it. Ob Obold? Obold? Don't know how to, thanks. Thanks so much, Joel. <laughs> I see him there. Thank you for doing that for us. Um, yeah, we sent these over to him to be able to check out for us and, you know, test out. We like to try out the things that we have. And um, this is, let me get it over here on the, here we go. Men's athletic shorts. These are really nice too. Again, with the pockets, we do like the pockets. Seem like you were very comfortable in them. They look like very comfortable shorts um, to be able to work out in and um, you know have room to be able to put your, your cell phone in, to carry a towel in. They have a lot of nice features on them. It has a drawstring closure on it. They're on deal today, 49% off. So this is, a, this is a really good price, okay? $15 and 20, so he loves them, Kaylee says. Yes, he loves them. $15 and 26 cents on the men's athletic shorts. And I just have to, give me one second, because I have to just um, refresh my page over here so that I can see where my videos are, okay. And all right, let's pull this up for a second so we can see Joel in his shorts. There we go, all right, there we go. <laughs> all right, so here, there he's showing you the pocket, the pocket that's there. It's kind of a hidden pocket. These are a double layer shorts. So you've got the tighter part, you know, that's up against your skin, and then you get the looser short above it. Um, so it is two layers. You got a zippered pocket in the back. You got pockets in the front. Um, and then a hidden pocket, like I showed you. And then there's this loop here too, to be able to throw your towel in. So if you're working out and you need to, um, you know, carry a towel, you can do that as well. Oh, I'm, I'm moving on to the next thing here. So let me just stop that. I'm trying something new as usual <laughs> and trying to figure out how to make it work, but we'll get there. All right, so there you go. Those are the shorts. Did anybody pick a pair of these up for their partner or for themselves even um, the last time we showed it to you? I know that it was a pretty popular uh, a pretty popular thing to look at last time that we were, Joe was showing them to you and um, 
everybody was saying, oh, my partner would love those. My husband would love those. Yeah. What you thought that was a bar of soap at first? What is she talking about? I don't even know. Alyssa, she's she's asking you, Kaylee. <laughs> the Tazos. Oh, the Tazos. Yes, the Tazos. My Tazos came in really handy this weekend. You want to hear what I did with my Tazos? So we were on that um, RV trip, RV trip, the camper van. We went on the camper van last week on our vacation, as most of you know. And I bought both pairs of my Tazos. And there was like in the kitchen area of the um, of the camper, there was like um, sort of like a, a, a countertop that folds down so that you can extend it, like lift up the wood and make it a bigger countertop for when you wanna cook something. And the little uh, handle underneath had broke. And so it needed like just something to be able to wedge in there to hold it up. And would you know, the thing that fit perfectly, like, like literally perfectly to just slide right in there, it was my Tazo. So I was so happy that I actually brought them on my trip because it made all the difference to be able to use our uh, our countertop. So we were laughing saying the Tazos, they come through again. There you go. You know, and I had my pink ones this time. So, you know, that was the other good part. Uh, yeah, for the size reference, yeah. <laughs> all right. What's next on the list here? Let's keep moving along. We've got this um, cute women's sarong. Okay, it's a short sarong. I brought this on my trip too. These come in a set of two. They're super cute. You can use them over a bathing suit. You can use them around your waist. You can use them around your top. You can use them as a shawl. They, um, you can use these in all different ways and they do come in a pack of two and they're just really nice, all different prints. What I like about these is that they come in a set where you can have a solid and a print. So you can kind of, you know, spice it up if you want to with the, with the print or have the solid. Um, but these really come in handy. And I think that, you know, you think of only wearing it maybe around your waist, but there are other ways to wear it. And I'll show you some of the pictures here so you can see uh yeah here you go okay so here's some of the pictures to be able to see like different ways that you can actually wear the sarong it's a short sarong it's for you know again for the beach it's sheer it's chiffon they come in sizes small through 3xl okay so all different sizes and um these are the actually this is the single one. Okay, this is not the this is not the set. This is the single that's on sale to, on deal today. So it's six six dollars and ninety nine cents for the sarong, which is a really good price, um, and it is a really nice sarong. Look at how cute that is. All right, so if you wanted to like, and if you wanted to wear it at night, and you wanted to have like a little shawl, or you wanted to wear it, say you wanted to cover up on top a little, you could just wrap it around the top of you here, maybe over a bathing suit. It is a little sheer, so I don't think you'd wear it by itself. Um, but it could be worn over the top to just kind of like cover the midsection if you wanted to. Um, you know, it, it's different, all different ways to wear it and different colors. So you could see here, I'm kind of wearing it like just over the top here, which could kind of be cute. Not maybe not over the shirt, um, but here's the sarong. And again, these are on deal. They are 46% off today. Okay. So many choices on the prints. Yeah, there's so many choices and they're cute, right? You got all the leopard prints. Um, I've got this one here. What would you call that? That's like a zebra. It's not zebra. I don't know what this is. I can't think of what animal this would be. Can you guys tell me what you think that is? <laughs> Kaylee's like, hmm, I don't know. Maybe it's just a print. I don't know what it is. It's not, not zebra. It's not leopard. It's cute though, right? It's like that black and white print here, but I don't know. Tiger, maybe tiger. I don't know. I don't know what I don't know which one this would be. This was the this was the set of two that I had gotten it. It was the um this print and the black together. Um, but I thought those were really nice. It was nice to take on my vacation with me. You would call it zebra? Yeah, like I wanted to say zebra, but like is that really what a zebra looks like? I don't know. Like zebras seem more like stripes, right? It's kind of weird. I don't know. It looks like an animal print, but I'm not sure what animal I would say this is. Siberian tiger. There we go. Siberian it's something. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what that is. Hmm. Yeah. Say we stumped you today. What? What is that? I don't know. Maybe Joe knows. I don't know. 
Jeff's, I don't know if he's listening to me right now, but he might, he might know what it is. All right. So next up, we are going to show you, um, let's switch gears a little bit. Okay. We have some other products here in the carousel. Um, I also want to do a giveaway. Okay. So we're going to have a giveaway coming up. So stay tuned. Did everybody put their member ID number into the chat? You guys know what to do, right? Once you come in, you put your new member ID number right here into the chat. You check in, you let us know so Kaylee knows and can mark you off on the list that you are here. Um, so that way when we do our giveaways tonight, you are eligible for our giveaways, okay? I know a lot of other live streams here on Amazon. You just have to come in and anybody can win. For us, we keep it to our community, so you do have to register. So you're gonna head over to mbe.live and or to mybabyexperts.com right on our website. It takes a moment. You just fill it out and you will be able to um, be eligible for all of our giveaways just by registering on our website. Okay. Um, so let's see here. The next one up, I'm going to show you. Let's do the top end. Okay, so the next one up is the Toppin. This is the air purifier by Toppin. Um, and this is one that we use in the house very often. So I don't know where it is. I thought that it was here. Uh, hold on a second. I hear Joe. Oh, it's over on the shelf. Maybe it's on the shelf there. I'm not sure. This is the small air purifier. It's good for your bedroom. It's good for um, like to put on a desk if you have an office, like a home office. It's good to keep inside your um, your kitchen so that it can um, clean up. There it is. Thank you, Joe. Appreciate that. <laughs> but let me show you how small this is. Okay, so it's really not going to take up a lot of space. So if you have a small room, so you have like a nursery, okay, or your bedroom or somewhere where you just want to Make sure that the air is circulating, that you're getting rid of any kind of impurities, any kind of contaminants in the air, any dust or odors maybe in the kitchen. Um, this is a really nice one to be able to just sit down on a, on a table or a desk or in the corner, wherever you want to put it. Um, but it's going to clean off the air for you and do it without taking up a lot of space. And it's really not loud either. So that makes it really good for a baby's... Um, for a baby's room as well. Uh, hold on, here we go. All right, so this one is on deal today. 33% off on the Toppin HEPA air purifier. Okay, I'm gonna try to get this up on the screen for you. Here you go. So you can kind of see it a little bit bigger. There you go, the air purifier. Okay, if you have like pollen, okay, that you're, you're, have, you're sensitive to or dust or um, anything like that, it's, it's cleaning the air with a UV light. And it has a quiet three speed um, fan motor on it. So it's not gonna make a lot of noise like you're saying. Um, and then it also, you can also add some drops of essential oil into this one. Not all of them you can do that with, but with this one you can. So if you wanted to have like a little bit of you know, lavender oil, maybe it's for your bedroom or something and you wanna just make it smell nice, okay? You can do that with a little sponge that's in there and add a little bit of oil to um, to the, to the purification, okay? Um, it's really important, we've talked about this so many times about, you know, really making sure that the quality of your air that you're breathing, that your, that the air quality is good, okay? It's something that we don't think about often enough is our indoor air quality, but with the doors closed, I mean, I know here, like, and probably everywhere where it's very hot in the South and out West right now, you think about like the winter time having the doors closed, but it's really like in the summertime, you're really running the air conditioning most of the time. You keep the dirt, you're keeping your doors closed. Their air is not circulating. And it's really important to keep clearing out that air. And it's not just from what's coming in from outside, but from all the stuff that we have in our homes too. You know, it collects dust um, through our vents. There's a lot of dust. Um, and if you have pets, You've got pet dander and everything else that's going in. It's, it's in the air and then we're breathing it. All right. So you want to be really careful about keeping your air quality um, good and something that's going to be able to alert you as to how good the air quality is and turn on and and you can use it. And this one will do that. So um, that's a really good that's a really good thing to have. You want to also pay attention when you're getting an air purifier that you get the appropriate um, purifier for the size of the room if you really want it to work well okay and this one here 
is going to work for 160 square feet. Okay, now it's not a very big purifier. So you want to make sure that if you know, if you have a room that's small, it will work. But if you're trying to like, do an entire floor of your house, you're going to obviously need a much bigger unit. All right, so make sure that you get the proper one. And there's the air, there's the aromatherapy. I like the ones where you could put the essential oils in there, you know, so that you can actually use it as a diffuser at the same time as a um, as an air purifier. All right, perfect for small rooms. Yes, baby's room, office, bedrooms. That's exactly what it is. Exactly what it's for. All right. Next up, uh, an oldie but a goodie here. I'm going to show you the. Space saver bags. Who loves the space saver bags? I love them. I use them. Um, I actually use them for, um, you know, packing things away. If I want to use, if I want to put something away. This does show you this before. Okay, this is still the original. Look how long this has lasted. The original time that we uh, vacuum sealed these stuffed animals that Joe showed you. Um, they're still vacuum sealed and they take up so much less space. You can actually, you know, stack them once you actually uh, suck the air out of these bags. They come in different sizes. I believe the one that um, is here in the carousel is a 12 pack with the uh, pump. And these Space Saver bags, um, this week, when, a couple of weeks ago, when I moved my kid to school, um, we just used them even to just bring stuff in without even vacuum sealing them. They're good for any kind of storage. We didn't need extra space and we were gonna unpack quickly, but it was a way to like, you know, not have to fit trunks into the car or like it doesn't take up any extra room. So it's a good way to pack up like, you know, clothes, towels, sheets, things like that. Um, and then if you wanna vacuum seal them for long-term storage and saving on space, Carla says, I love them. Daisy says, I love them. Laura says, I love them. Yes, you all love, I love them too. Anything I can vacuum seal, I love. You guys know that I'm a little bit of a freak with the vacuum sealing. I like to vacuum seal my food. <laughs> Anything I could get my hands on. I've taught my kids how to use the vacuum sealer. I'm like, you got to put it back in. You got to, once you open it, you got to vacuum seal it again. Um, but this is obviously not for food. It's for your clothes, your towels, your sheets, your blankets, your comforters, your winter clothes, your cloth diapers, your anything you want that you want to actually, you know, store away maybe your baby clothes um you know saving it for next baby right there you go this particular pack is a 12 pack and um it's going to come with three small three medium three large and three jumbo okay as well as the uh the hand pump so let me just pop that up on the screen so you can see what they look like here Ah, there you go. Okay, so all the different sizes. I think it's nice to have the variety pack so that you can actually, um, you know, choose the size that you need for a particular, whatever the situation is, you know, whether it's clothes or sheets. I mean, the jumbo, have you guys tried the jumbo bag? It fits so much. Like you could put so much inside that jumbo bag and you're getting three of the jumbo. I mean, I, sometimes I pull out the large and I'm like, this must be the biggest one. And then I go back and I'm like, oh, wait, there's one even bigger. You can fit multiple like a, huge comforters in it and things like that. The stuff that like the bulky stuff like that takes up so much space in the closets. If you can get it to like get the air out, um, you're going to save so much room. OK, and then also for packing, you know, so if you're traveling and you want to take things into a suitcase, it will definitely make it easier to pack more into a smaller uh, suitcase. And then it has that hand pump so that you could use it with your vacuum cleaner or you can use the hand pump, which I love because then you could take it with you. If you don't have a vacuum cleaner to come back, you do need to suck the air back out to get your stuff back into the suitcase that you had it in. So um, we're going to be giving away a pack of these right now. OK, so if you're here with us and you have a member ID number, it's time for our first giveaway of the evening. And um, uh, good luck to everyone here who has a chance to win. I hope that you are joining us and uh, you loved those space sabers for your beach trip. Yes, totally, totally in it to win it. There we go. Fit three kids clothes in one suitcase, which with eight people riding the car it was a must. That's exactly it right there. Faith, you said it. Okay. So like you're in the car, you have just enough space, like you have just whatever space you have 
and you want to fit more, get those things into space saver bags, suck that air out, and you're going to have so much more room to be able to fit more. And take it from me, there's always more you want to bring, right? Because I don't pack light. <laughs> Who else doesn't pack light? I don't pack light. That's just my thing. I don't know why. Every time I go away, I'm like, okay, to this time, I'm not taking too much. This, I don't need that much. I don't need to take that much, right? But then just like little by little, I don't know. Like we need a lot. Who uses, I use a lot of things. Like I have a lot of things and I have a lot of, a lot of things I like. So I want to bring them with me when I like my pillow, I got to bring my pillow with me. I got to bring all my clothes with me. I have to bring all my toiletry. Like there's just everything. So I don't know. I think I packed a lot. This time I try, I really tried not to pack too much because we were in a small space. Okay. That, our, that camper van was not a big thing. And literally like the space like this big and maybe is like, it was like this to this. Okay. was the space I had to fit all my personal stuff, like my clothes, all my things. Um, luckily everything fit and I didn't use everything I brought because let's face it, just wear the same thing day after day. Often you're at the beach where, what are you actually doing? Right. So I know for next time, and we're going again in October camping, and I think I'm going to tr really try to pack less this time. I'm going to pack less. Um, when you go, always pack the kitchen sink and bathroom sink. That's me, Bray. I can't pack everything. I like to take my house with me because I like all my comforts of everything around me, all my things. I don't know. Who, who takes your pillow when you, when you travel? Am I the only one who does that? Do you guys take a pillow with you? Do you do that too, Kaylee? You do, right? I don't know. I like my pillow. And I'm always afraid, like, what if I get there and I don't like the pillows? Like, pillows are like a big thing. Like, it's important, right, to have the right pillow. Um, so I take my pillow. What is something else that I take? I take my pillow with me. Um, I always take extra underwear with me. Like, always extra. <laughs> That's something that has to, I have to have extra. Um... I like to, I don't take a lot of jewelry or anything like that. I could get away with wearing the same thing over and over. That that stuff's not a thing for me. But um, do I want to announce the winner in the chat or notification? Let's just do it in the chat tonight. Let's start right in the chat, okay? Kaylee's going to throw the winner member ID number into the chat. She's running the giveaways on the back end here. Where's Joe tonight? Joe's upstairs. Joe's taking a break and I'm doing the live stream tonight. You know, sometimes he streams, sometimes I stream, sometimes we stream together. I don't know. We just, he took a break. <laughs> he, actually, Tali was home from school and they were working on stuff with the car and doing stuff like that. And I'm like, I will take it. I will take it from here. So yeah, pillows and covers um, here. Three kids. I always overpack always always right and and you know it's like and when you have little ones oh my god when the kids were little it was like this stroller and that stroller and this carrier and that carrier and then they need their blankets and then they need their clothes and an extra clothes because you know someone's going to puke on something so i'm going to need extra even in the car right and i was just i just remember like trying to pack light for we never called it vacation with the kids we just called it traveling traveling you know like we had some good travels with the kids because it's not really a vacation is it um but yeah we always overpacked and it was kind of nice it's kind of nice to go away just us now you know where i don't have to think about anyone else i don't have to pack for anyone else so that was kind of nice kaylee said plus you need to plan for like five outfit changes a day for the little that's true right they need so much and you know and figure out where the laundromats are too, because no matter what you bring, you're still going to need to wash their favorite stuff that got dirty anyway, right? Mm -hmm. So yeah, I brought some laundry detergent. We wound up need, not needing to do laundry while we were away, but that's always an option, right? You can always throw it into stop at a laundromat and do a load, right? All right. So we have a winner. Do we have a winner announced in the chat yet? We do. Who was the winner? Do we know? Can I see it? Uh, who's the winner? Oh, announcing now. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, Kaylee. 
All right, I'll keep talking here. I'll just keep moving on, all right? Next up, we have the Nebula, okay? I know we went over this with you guys last night. This was the Nebula that we had in the RV with us. So there's several different versions of the Nebula um, by Anchor, okay? These are the projectors. Um, we love the projectors. Um, this particular one is amazing, okay? This is the uh, Anchor Solar FHD 1080 projector, okay? It's a 4K uh, projector. It has the audio sound with it. It has a digital zoom. It has screen mirroring for your phones. It has the... Um, you know, you can you can set up with your fire stick right to it. It does such a beautiful projection and it's not just for um, outdoors. Like this is great for outdoors. I mean, you could set up a nice big screen, you can watch outdoors, but you can also use it indoors. And we actually used it while we were in the camper van. There was no TV in the van, but we wanted to watch some stuff and literally just plugged in our fire stick and projected right onto the wall and it was so fun to be able to just watch a movie right there and it gives you that option to have tv entertainment inside outside wherever you want and this particular one will actually um project from the side too and i'm going to show you an image here so you can see what that looks like but it's really, really nice um, projector. It's a beautiful projector. And Nebula makes, they, they, Anchor makes a bunch of different Nebulas. They have different sizes. Um, do I have the small one here? Yeah, I have one here. This is the smaller version. So you can see this one's like just the size of a soda can. Um, give you this one. Look at how small this is. Okay, so this is another version of it. So there's all different types of Nebula by Anchor to do these, um, to do this screen projection. But this particular one, and I do have a video too, of uh, I, I actually show, I could show it to you. But see, this one will actually project from the side. So where's that picture? Here's the picture. Can you see this good? All right. So you can see, you can put it on a table or something off to the side of where you're sitting. Um, you know, so that it's not right in front of you. And that makes a difference because like, say you have a bunch of people that are sitting in rows to watch a movie or something like that. Now you've got to find some place to put it in the middle or like right in front of your face, which is not that fun, okay? Um, having it off to the side where it doesn't distort the image is a really nice way to, um, to watch it. And it goes up to 120 inches there. You can see these are on deal, 17% off. Um, not cheap okay they're not they're not they're not cheap they're not inexpensive but if you're looking at the cost of you know a big screen tv and you don't have maybe the space where a big screen tv will be um, permanently there okay this is a way to have that picture of a big of a large screen um, have it a little bit more mobile and be able to use it in different rooms or whenever you, whenever you need it pull it out and 120 inches is huge okay it's really huge so um, this is a really nice projector. Let me see if I can get this here. Here's, here it is in the box. You can see what it comes with. There's the projector. It's not, it's not very large. It's kind of flat. Um, and then you can see the different um, inputs on the back of there. Um, and you can insert, that's how you can insert your fire stick right there, your charging of it. It's got the nice um, zoom lens, digital zoom lens on the front, autofocus. Um, it's got a built-in stand so that you can tilt it upward. You don't have to prop it with anything. It has a stand included. And then in the box, it's also going to come with the um, remote control and, of course, its own power cords for charging. All right. So who won? Daisy? Yay. Congrats, Daisy. Congrats. Daisy is our first winner tonight. Yay. All right. So there you go. That's the nebula. Does anybody have a projector? Does anybody have a projector at home? Any kind of projector? Anybody using a projector right now? Anybody buy one since we started showing these to you? I and mean, we've been showing them to you for years now, our projectors, all different kinds of projectors, but these nebulas have been actually um, our favorite. I'm just going to leave that here. Hold on. Anybody have one? I know there's a delay, so I have to, I always have to remember to wait for your answer because I'll keep talking here. <laughs> you don't have one, Margaret says, I don't have one. You don't have one. Yeah, these are like, I don't know, holidays coming up. 
you know, and I think these are like a really nice family gift. Do you guys ever do that? Like just a gift for everybody in the family, something that everyone's going to enjoy. So you can kind of like, you know, buy it and everybody gets a present out of it. Um, I think those are some of the best presents and especially ones where you, um, you can have more family time by using it, right? So like, this is the kind of thing that the family can all use together, whether you're away or I loved bringing it with us. Um, I'm eyeing one for Christmas. Yes, Faith. I think it's perfect for that. My dad usually does a family gift. This is a good thing to ask for. Like if you're, if your parents are like, what can I buy for you guys as a family gift? I'd go with something like this for sure. Anchor is awesome. Yes, it is. Last year it was the Nintendo switch. Yeah. So there you go. Those are nice big family gifts that you can all have fun with. Yep. I asked for silverware last year. <laughs> That was my family gift. Like, we need new silverware. My mother-in-law brought me bought me silverware. All right. Uh, okay. Perfect. Perfect. So you guys know, like, if you're watching right now and you're not following, please hit the follow button, okay? If you're watching us somewhere here on Amazon, you don't know who we are. I'm Sherry, and this is my baby experts, and this is our wonderful community all jumping in for Friday night. Uh, live stream. I'm going to turn on a fan right now because it is getting warm. I go from cold to hot. There you go. Unmute the stream. That's right. Unmute the stream and say hi. Say hello and join us for some nice deals here and some fun and some prizes. And if you're not registered, go over to me.live and make sure that you're registered. Um, Faith said, just imagine game night using a projector. Yes, it would be fun, right? Isn't that fun? Use, use it for your games, for sure. For movies, for games. It's even great for like, um, if you have home movies or slide, like pictures you wanna put up, like slideshows, like that's fun too. If you have any family parties that you're gonna be having, um, it's always fun to do um, home movies. Here's what I'm gonna tell you guys. So I know a lot of you have little ones at home. Make sure you're taking tons of video, okay? I know that you probably are. When my kids were little, we were taking video with the video camera. So it was a little bit more difficult. Kaylee's laughing at me because she's saying, now you're old. Now you're showing how old you are, right? We had a video camera. Um, but make sure you're taking lots of video. It's for them, really. They love, like, looking back now to watch when they were little, it seems like this time is going to last forever. But I have to tell you, the more video you take, it'll be like the most fun family nights to sit there and just watch old family videos of when you were doing the exact same thing, but they were little. So I don't know if you guys have um, live older ones now that you're watching home movies with, but we do that. And it's always our fun thing to do when we're together is watch our home movies. Joe was really good about that. Like he, that I have to say like Joe was really good about recording, you know, we right now, I mean, we're so spoiled now with our phones because we can record all the time. Um, but back then it was like, not as easy like you really had to like commit to that to like make sure you got the video camera out and that you videotaped and we were doing that back then so we have a lot of good memories um all right we had one of the big ones for your little sister you remember the well you remember the video cameras is that what you're saying <laughs> i'll show you mine and you can laugh at me at one of these days okay it's actually not a big camera it's a little tiny camera that we had little tiny we had a big one then we had a smaller one all right what's next let's just go right down the line here we got the Bissell little green machine here on Bissell Bissell machine is right here oh this is such a nice little cleaning machine for your carpets your upholsteries okay if it, it, it's nice because it's easy to transport okay so many of the steam cleaners are you know big bulky hard to use on staircases hard to use on upholstery um if you want to use something that's going to be easy to take the hose out you know easily take out the hose it just snaps right out of here okay and now you've got a hose that's really easy to um, reach for things it's not a cordless thing so it does have a cord here um, but it is going to be easy to um, take this out and um, use it for 
cleaning. Um, does anybody own Abyssal? Because this is a really good price right now. Uh, let's see, one oh nine fifty nine for the little green machine. Let me put this up on the screen for you. Put the machine on the screen. Here you go. Okay, so the Bissell little green machine. Okay, it's again portable. One of the things I really could not could not stand with our last um, steam cleaner, like carpet cleaner, was just how big and bulky it was. I couldn't even carry it up the stairs. Forget trying to clean the stairs with it. All right, this was just is so much easier to be able to do those smaller little messes. Okay. And we know there's lots of little messes with little ones and also with pets. Okay. So if you have, that's the problem we have is lucky. Just, I don't know. Lucky, like lucky. I'm just going to me for a second. I'm going to, I'm going to tell you this. Okay. So lucky is a male dog. Okay. He's almost 12 years old and this dog doesn't matter. He knows where to go pee. He knows. Okay. But he likes to mark. And I've never had a male dog. This was our first male dog. I always had female dogs, never marked, never had that problem. Male dogs, they like to mark. Little stinker. Like, and he knows, like he waits till I'm not looking. And he has to wear a diaper now. Cause ever since we moved into this house, he's ruined carpets, he's ruined floors. I'm like, enough. Okay. So they do make like little diapers for dogs, especially male dogs, very easy to cover them up. And so we just put a diaper on him. And so you've seen him sometimes where I'm holding him and he's got something wrapped around his body. That's, that's a diaper. All right. So that he doesn't pee on my, on the edge of my table or on my sneakers, anything I leave on the floor, he'll go lift his leg and try to mark it. Um, and so lucky is, you know, just like, and I, and, and he's old, like, there's no way I'm going to train him at this point. He's just doing what he's doing. So he does it. And he'll wait till I'm, I could see him like out of the corner of my eye. He waits till I'm not looking. And then I catch him and he, he gets this like guilty look on his face. It's the funniest thing. Like he knows he's doing it, but he can't stop himself. It's just this, I don't know. Um, need this for your crazy boy. Carla says he's always into something. He was just helping me unload the dishwasher and dropped a glass. Yeah. With three kids and three dogs, we need one of these. I loathe bringing out the giant one and trying to lug 30 pounds up the stairs to the back. That's it. That That's what I'm talking about. Faith. If it's, if it's not convenient, you're not going to use it. And that's the problem. Like you might get one that's like the biggest, heaviest duty. And if you're going to clean an entire carpet, like from like wall to wall carpeting, then yes, maybe one of those is going to work. But in that case, you hire someone to come clean your carpets, okay? If you're going to do wall-to-wall -wall carpeting. What we really need these cleaners for is mostly for those occasional spot cleaning where you need to get something out. And so, you know, I say save the money on the big, large cleaners and the ones that are heavy that you can't lift up the stairs and get yourself one of these little green ones so that you can use it. You know, if it's convenient, you'll use it more. And that's really, that is really the truth. Okay. So um, this is in here. I can show you a picture here so you can see it. Um, I've always had, Carla said, I've always had male dogs. They never peed in the house. My husband had a female dog before we got together and she peed everywhere in my house. Isn't that crazy? I guess it has to do with just the dog. I don't know. All my female dogs never did that. Um, baby boy is mobile now. Laura says, can't have him picking up pet hair need this there's so many things i mean like all these like little tools that make it easier um are going to you know something spills on the carpet right you can see it right here uh able to just go ahead and clean up that spot and also your car and you can't bring out your huge um you know cleaner out into the if you have a huge you know, regular stand-up cleaner that's not going to work for your car. This one you could actually bring out, clean up the upholstery in your car. And I don't know how many times I've had to do that when I had littles from all kinds of stuff happening, right? If they can do it, they will. <laughs> if they can get it dirty, they will get it dirty. That's what they do. All right. So that's the little green machine. Uh, let's see. You're potty training your son right now. Yeah, potty training. Oh, Keely, is, 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 is Eli potty trained yet? No, not yet. Let me tell you. Here's how you do it, okay? Here's what I had to do. It was just, it literally was a matter of a weekend job for us. It was like, take off their diaper for one, it took about a weekend for both kids. 
when they were ready, just took it off and let them be naked for like a couple days and just watch them and let them sit on towels. <laughs> Lots of accidents. Um, but we got it over with quickly. That worked. They did what it did work to make it happen fast. So maybe you'll need the little green machine now when you do that. I could have used that when I was potty training for sure. Uh, all right. Let's see. He gets annoyed and he wants to, I told you, Eli likes what he likes. And you can't, I could tell. He's just, you can't push him. You cannot push him. You know, some kids you could like encourage them and they'll do it. I could see like you encourage him and he doesn't want to. He's going to run in the other direction. He just doesn't. He's got a mind of, that's a good thing. That's a good quality though. Right now it's, it's hard, but it's a good quality. He's got a mind of his own. You want them to be able to have their own opinions on things for sure. Just not when they're disagreeing with you, right? Mm hmm All right. <laughs> What's next here? Ah, the Ace Mining Portable Door Locks. Uh, we got a video for that. Kaylee did a video for that. Let's see. Let's get that up on the screen here. Oh, I got sound on this one here. We got some music. We need some music tonight. For some reason, that music just does not good. Huh, Kaylee? Not working. Anyway, these are the portable door locks, okay, from Ace Mining. These are fantastic for being able to just lock up any door um, where you can say you're in a hotel room and you want to get that extra security, okay? Um, little portable door locks so that you can make sure that one, nobody can get in, and two, if you got little ones who can unlock the door, <laughs> they can't unlock this and it will be a way to keep them from getting out, okay? It's also really um, easy to install, as you can see here, um, you just kind of lift that up and pull it out and it comes out. And um, so it's going to be easy if you have to get out quickly, no problem. This is a two pack and they are on deal. Um, let's see, the price on these tonight is $13.99 on the two pack, which is really nice. Okay. If you're going on vacation, if you're staying in a VRBO, if you're like wherever you are, you know, that you want to be able to lock that door and have a little bit more security. Um, having one of these or having two of these, um, maybe it's your apartment, you know, wherever it is, it's just being able to put that, it's almost like putting a chain on your door without having to install a chain. I mean, that that's the best kind of way I could, you know, give you the analogy for this, right? If you can't install anything, but you want to have the idea of like a chain lock on your door, this is it, all right? Two pack for $13.99. They're actually really small too, so they're easy to pack with you and take with you wherever you're going. Um, Kaylee said, this lock was so easy to install, definitely rental and vacation friendly, for sure, for sure. Um, Bree said, JJ is learning to unlock the door at the apartment and it scares me that he's gonna get out. Bree, it should scare you. <laughs> you don't want him to get out. Okay, so that's exactly what we're talking about. Something like that, you pop this on your door, he's not going to be able to get out. And that's really so important is to make sure that they're secure because those little, they get, before you know it, they can, they can get out quickly and you got to really watch them. You know, you got to really watch them because you're talking about something very dangerous for them to get outside. So yes, this is very cool, isn't it? Okay. Kaylee, let's give some away. We're going to give away a, pa a two pack. All right. Two pack of the Ace Mining Portable Door Locks right now. We're giving them away. Make sure that you have your member ID number in the chat. Um, from before, you don't need to do it again. If you already did it um, before, you ha we have you on the list there, okay? But you do need to have your number here at one point so that we can get you into the giveaway tonight. Uh, hello, Reagan. Thanks for joining us. Everybody's here. Yay. All right. Bree's here. Yes. Bree's crossing her fingers. Margaret's here. All right. Kaylee's going to run that drawing and then put the number into the chat for us. Okay. Anybody have any good plans for the weekend? Anybody have any good um, weekend? It is Friday. That's I was saying before, that's what's so weird about coming back midweek. Cause it doesn't feel like it should be Friday already, but it is. So it's kind of crazy. I'm like happy about that, but we are going to be streaming. I think we're streaming Sunday and Monday. We'll be here back on Amazon live with you guys. So we're going to be spending some time together. We took some time off and now we're back. 
Um, Laura says, both my 22 and eight year olds snuck out of the house at age two and four, hoping current baby doesn't try the same. <laughs> Sounds like they're go they're go they're it's in the family there, Laura. I would make sure I get some uh, ace mining door locks on your doors for sure. Jennifer saying, Reagan, you got to put your number in. Yes, you do, Reagan. Do you have a number? If you have a number, please put it here into the chat. Thank you for our community staying on top of it. There you go. Totally on it, Laura says. Yeah, good. Yeah. Yes, Reagan, you have to have your number here in order to win. Thank you, Jennifer. You do need to, you do need to have your number here. Okay. Um, let's see. What is next on the list here? What do we got? I feel like I need music. We need music. Can I, should I try the music, Kaylee? Should I try it and tell me if it's too loud? All right, you tell me if it's too loud, okay? Let's try it. Is it good? You guys, is it too loud? I need something. It's too quiet. Just the sound of my own voice. Is the music too loud for you guys? Tell me. We're trying to work out the music situation. It's perfect. Can you hear me over the music? No problem. It's kind of cool, right? It's kind of like a nice beat. Okay, that's what I needed to keep me going here. Okay, good. Good. All right. Next up, we have, oh, perfect. We have a uh, speaker from Anchor, okay? <laughs> Speaking of music, we've got speakers here. Um, this is the Soundcore uh, Bluetooth speaker from Anchor. Okay, let um, me pop this on the screen for you so you can see it. Um, okay, I actually have it here. Hang on. Okay, so this is the Soundcore speaker. Can you see the size of this? It's a nice small speaker but it sounds so good, okay? This is a really nice, um, good quality sound. It's in a very small um, footprint, so you're not gonna take up a lot of space, but you got beautiful sound coming out of this. It's got 24 hours of play time on it, so you can charge it up, you can take it with you, and it's wireless. It's going to um, hook right you know, to your Bluetooth um, on your mobile phone, on your any of your devices. It's gonna connect really easily, um, and it's portable, okay? so. It'll connect to iPhones, it'll connect to Samsung, anything you want, okay? 24 hours of battery life, that's a long time, okay? So you wanna go to the beach for the day. You wanna take it with you? This is a waterproof um, speaker, so you don't have to worry about it, all right? You can just set it right outside and you've got a nice little speaker there, you can see it, from Anchor, okay? These are 27% off today at $21.99, okay? That's an amazing deal for this cute little speaker here, all right? $21.99. I also like the way it feels. It's got that very, like, I don't know, I'm very tactile. Like, I like the way things, I like to feel things and see how they feel. This actually feels, it's just got a nice, smooth, um, really smooth surface to it. And I don't know if you can see the top here, but it's got, like, these big buttons. So it's really easy to, can you see that? like big buttons that are on the top. There we go. I can get my eyes out of it, it'll, I don't know if it'll, uh, it won't do it, I don't know why. But anyway, um, what's nice about that, it's almost like they're raised buttons so you can feel, if you're, if you can't see, if you're reaching over to adjust it, you can feel without having to look at it. So it's really nice. Um, and they do come in three different colors. I'm not sure if they're all on deal. Let's see if they're all on deal here. We've got the, I'm gonna pop this on the screen so you can see it. Oh, there we go. Okay, you got the black, $21.99. The blue is also on deal, but $28.89. And then you got the red that I don't think is on deal, is not on deal, $35, okay? So $21 is a really good price for this speaker. If you've been looking for something to, was that not on a repeat there? Let's put this on repeat. Let's get that back on. I like that music, that was good. Okay, um, let me get that color for you here. So the black, you got the black, and then you got the blue. Okay, isn't that pretty? It's a pretty one. Who won? 
We don't know yet. We see a number. Do we have a winner yet? Not yet? All right. So winner, please claim. What was the number? The number was uh, Katie. Oh, congrats. Yay. It was Katie. She wins the door locks. Awesome. Awesome. That's awesome. All right. So there's the speaker for you. Stay on court. If you're looking for a good speaker, now's the time. This is the price for you, okay? Um, I love this. Let's see, $21.99. That's awesome. That's really a very good deal. Kaylee, do you have one of these? Do you have one? Of, do you have some kind of a speaker? A big one? A really big one? All right, how about Kaylee wins the black one today? Just remind me to order it for you after the show, okay? <laughs> yeah, everybody congratulate Katie Lee, she won the speaker. <laughs> yes, Eli will be thrilled. Okay, good, this is a good one. This is, it's nice and light. It's a good one to take with you somewhere, you know? Um, and it's easy to charge up, so you'll have the charge for a while too. I really like this one. Okay, so that's from Soundcore, Anchor, Anchor Soundcore speaker. All right, yes, nice, Kaylee wins. Sometimes Kaylee needs to win. She doesn't get to enter these giveaways, right? So Kaylee needs to win sometimes too. I like to surprise her. Okay, next up. Oh, uh, the Quinier is still on deal. You guys, if you like your feet massaged and your legs massaged, if you have poor circulation or if your legs just ache, I don't know, my legs ache by the end of the day. They ache from standing or they ache from sitting. It doesn't really matter what happens. And by the end of the night, my legs are aching. And this, these are my favorite ones. These, um, these compression boots from Quinier. There's two of them. They come in a set of two, obviously, for both legs, okay? And then they have the little control panel right on the um, right on the boot itself. Um, these are great after like a workout. They're great after being on your feet all day. Um, these are nice because, you know, some massagers where you have to actually put your feet into them, you have to keep your feet down, like down on the ground in order to do it. With the leg boots like this, you can, I like to put my feet up. When they're aching like that, they're swollen. I like to pe keep my feet elevated. And so you can actually put your feet up and, you know, just put them on. So sometimes like I'll get into bed and I'm, you know, my feet are aching and I can just slip my boots on and it gives me that nice, like kind of compression massage on my ankles, on my calves, on my feet. You can control it. It has different speeds and different, like compression levels, um, I guess that's what I would call it. And let me tell you, these things I paid, um, I paid twice the price and I'm not kidding. I mean like really twice the price on this. Hold on, something wacky is happening with my mouse now. Hold on. Uh, my mouse is not working. Ah, why did it do that? I don't know. Okay, I can't get to, I can't seem to get my mouse to work now. All right, you guys, I'm not gonna be able to share my screen, but I will just share this, okay? So these are the Quinier. Um, they do have, um, like I said, the controls right on there. If you're looking for something that doesn't have um, a remote control that's not connecting them, okay? So so a lot of these boots, like I was telling you yesterday, they get connected with the re with the um, the music is too loud. Okay, now it's too loud. Is that better? Tell me if that's better. It sounds better for me. Is that better? Okay, good. Um, a lot of times these boots have the remote controls or the cords between them. And um, for some people, they really do like to, um, they like to have them. But um, 
it, because you don't have to reach down to do anything. For me, I like to have the movement of my legs and then you're not supposed to walk in these, but sometimes I'll just turn them off and I can walk and go to the bathroom or do whatever I have to do. They do fit different sizes because it's all Velcro all the way around. Um, I'm just trying to get to the product because I want to be able to, um, oh, okay, it just started working again. Why? Don't know. Don't know. All right. Technology. Technology. All right. So these are normally $129.99. And I'm telling you, that's what I spent. I spent around 120 on these. And I know Marnie told us yesterday she spent like $100 on these for herself. Um, they're $55.24. Okay. $55. That's a really, really good price. These are the best prices I've seen on these um, Quinier yesterday and today on this deal. So if you've been thinking about this or you have somebody that maybe you're shopping for, maybe for holiday, okay? This is a great gift, $55.24. That's 58% off the price. I'm actually thinking about picking up a second pair right now at this price, at half price. Um, because if something, I mean, it's been a while. When did I buy these? Back in February, 2021, it's telling me. This is when I bought these. Um, and I've used them so many times, but I could really see like wanting a second pair at this price um, for sure. Um, okay, so let's see. Okay. Um, I think Joe's messaging me. Yeah, no, I'm okay. It's not the, the mouse didn't go. It just stopped clicking. I don't know why, but it's, it was still there. All right, so pick up those Quinier right now. If you don't have them, make sure that it's, it's loud. It's still too loud. All right, I'm shutting it off. We need to get it. We need to figure out the music, Kaylee. We need some music. It keeps me going. You know? It sounds very quiet in here. I see people clicking on the Quinn ears. Yeah, click over and take a look at it. You're really going to like, you're going to really like them. At least try them out. If you're like, if, if you've been wondering about them, um, this is probably a good time to go ahead and check them out. If you have somebody in your life who has, you know, diabetes or poor circulation or is maybe prone to blood clots or if you're going on a long trip or if you're flying or anything like that, if you're pregnant and you have swollen ankles and feet, um, compression is a, a great way to keep the legs, the, the, the circulation going in your legs, preventing blood clots and all the other things that we do not want. So um, yeah, having some kind of like compression boot like that. Plus what I love is it never gets tired. You know, like <laughs> you want more, you're like massage more, massage more. And you could just keep turning it on and it'll keep on going. They ch the charge lasts for a really long time. Like I hardly ever charge them and I use them all the time. So it I know that because I hardly ever charge them and they never, it just doesn't die. So that's a good thing. Um, let's see. What else is on deal still today? We got the portable clothesline still on deal. I love this thing. I told you guys, I want to, I want to, um, uh, what do you call it? Put some little baby clothes on here and show you how you can use this for like a baby shower, because I think this would be the cutest gift to give somebody for a baby shower. Like if you were going to buy them a whole bunch of like, you know, like little baby outfits or socks or things like that, you could string this along here. Okay, this is a um, portable clothesline. It's an elastic clothesline like this. It comes with the cutest um, clothes pins already attached to it, just like that. So, and it also has these like little little um, buttons that you can move the clothes pins so that they go into different areas. You can, you know, separate them out however you want to. Um, it has hooks on either end. Okay, so that you could hook it to something, whether whatever it is that you want to hook it to, or if you have nothing to hook it to, you could wrap it around a tree. If you're out, you know, maybe you're hiking or you're outside, you just want to wrap it around. It's going to stay attached right there. Okay. These are great for like, we had it on our um, camper van trip, RVs, campers, camping, um, backyards, the beach, wherever you need to hang anything up. Um, this would be uh, just a great way to do it. And 
it, um, you know, and like I was saying, it'd be really cute if you're trying to give a baby shower gift and you wanted to hang little baby clothes on here and let them just pull it out of a bag. Have you ever seen that where they just hang things on a clothesline and then they pull it out? This is the perfect one because then the clothesline itself is something that they can use as well. Um, this would be great for, uh, uh, I, Kite? Is it kite? Is that, is that the name? Is the baby's name? Kite? Baby clothes that has to be hung. What is that? That has to be hung up. Yeah. Carla's saying for baby clothes, for sure. For sure. Definitely. Okay. And this is um, on deal today. Okay. It's 42% off $7.52 for the clothesline. I'm actually going to pick up another one. Kaylee, can you remind me after the show? I'm going to buy, buy this while it's on deal. Um, reason being is while we were in our camper van, it, it, it just fit perfectly inside the van between these hooks that they had when we, we were able to actually wrap it twice and get it into a smaller spot. It can hang laundry right there if you're drying your bathing suits or if you wanted to hang a screen for the projector. So I just decided to leave it in the van for the next people who used it, like because it was just the perfect spot for it. So we actually gave our other one away. So I think we're going to grab another one for... Uh, for personal use. Sometimes we keep stuff in the studio here so that we can find it when we want to use it. All right. That's $7 and 52 cents on the um, portable clothesline. Okay. And it comes with these cute 12, 12 color, colorful clothes pins um, already attached to it. Okay. If you have a balcony or a deck, it's a good place you could put it there too. Um, you know, just different places. You'll find so many uses for this clothesline, I'm telling you. It's one of those things that comes in a little pouch too. So, and um, you know, it's the kind of thing I would just take on vacation with me. If I was going on vacation, you, you just wrap, look how small, you just wrap it up like that, put it, put it inside a little pouch and just take it with you. You're gonna find a use for it for sure. All right, so there is the clothesline. Stretchy, great for hotel rooms. Um, it's a brand of baby clothes. I gotcha. I gotcha. Okay. I'm, I guess I'm out of the loop with the baby clothes. <laughs> uh, uh, okay. Reagan got her number in. Excellent. All right. Good. Thank you. Perfect. Um, okay. Yes. It, once you put once you fill out the thing, you should get a text message that will have your number on it. If you don't get the text message, then you can always message Kaylee because we can look it up for you. Um, but make sure that you wait for your text message. And we also send out an email too, right, Kaylee? They get an email with their number. What you want to do is once you get your number, go put it into your account on um, on the website. Okay, so go sign in as your as a member on My Baby Experts, and in the account section, you'll see like under your, like where you put your address and your phone number, all that private information, there is a section that says um, member ID, just type it in there. Okay. Just type in your own five digit member ID number that we send you. And that's the one that you'll be able to use. We also have it on a list. So if you lose it and you need help, always reach out and we can do that too. Okay. Um, all right. Perfect. Next, we also have the Hamilton beach um, breakfast sandwich maker. Um, again, something that I cannot recommend more to you if you like breakfast sandwiches, if you like easy breakfast, easy ways to like, you know, serve up a little breakfast. Um, I love this thing. Like we use, this was like our thing that we took on the trip with us because we're like, what can we take that's small, that's easy. You need a few ingredients. You're making, like you can cook it like with an egg without having to have a frying pan and making everything dirty. So it's a really fast way to make an easy breakfast sandwich. You just stick your English muffin in there. You stick your, uh, I think I have a video, right? Don't we have a video of this? Let's get a video going of the, um, Hamilton. Yeah. Number five, hold on a second. Let me grab the video here. Uh, number five on here. There we go. Okay, so this is how you use it. Okay, so this is the single here. Um, we do have the double now too. The singles went off to the dorm rooms. Okay? <laughs> and, and Joe and I got a double because they do make a double on this breakfast sandwich maker. And that's really nice when you've got two of you and you both want a sandwich and you want to eat it at the same time. You can actually make them together, but the singles are nice and small so that um, they fit in small spaces. Um, literally see how it, 
has like the different sections to it. You lift up the bot, you lift up the whole thing, you put your English muffin on the bottom. And then you'll add like your cheese and whatever else you want to put on it. I like Taylor ham on mine. Joe likes his chicken sausage and whatever else that you want to do. You can put veggies on it if you like. Um, here he's doing it. Is that sped up there? Yeah. So you got to wait, wait for it to heat up. You stick your, look how easy this is. Okay. Stick your English muffin in. You stick the rest of your stuff in. Put your cheese on. Okay. You lower it down. You crack an egg and just kind of mix it up right there. You don't even have to fry the egg. And you throw your English muffin on the top. You let it cook. Okay. Could it be any easier than this? He's pouring our coffees there. Now I want it. I think I'm going to have a breakfast sandwich for dinner. It's making me hungry. All right. You slide that middle section out and then the egg drops onto the other rest of the sandwich. And there you go. You got your breakfast sandwich. It's delish. Okay. It's really delish. This is um, on deal today. These are $24.99. It's 17% off. They come in different colors. The ones that are on, um, the one that's on deal is the black. That's the one we have too at $24. But if you like pretty colors and you're thinking, oh, I'd like to get something, you know, a little bit more, um, you know, get that. you got that pretty pink one here. This is a coral. You got this mint, which is really cute. You got a red one and then you got the silver. Okay. And they're $29.98 for the singles there. And then if you are so inclined and would like to have a double, uh, here's the doubles. You can see the double here. All right. $46.99. They're not on deal today. This is the one that this is the one that we got, the double one um, with a timer that Joe and I bought so we can eat breakfast together. Right. There, you could see some veggies on it too. It's really yummy. I mean, who doesn't like a breakfast sandwich? You can also make other things. Like you can make um, like pizza bagels. You can make open face sandwiches too. You don't have to put a top on it if you wanted to make something else in it. So, and it is really easy to clean up. They do come off and go right into the dishwasher. That'd be, it's a nice, it's a nice way to make a fast breakfast for the kids before school. You know, um, Talia has it in the dorm room. And I know they're using it for making breakfast sandwiches, you know, before class. A lot easier to do that. So maybe I shouldn't say that. I'm not sure she's supposed to have it, but. <laughs> Just ratted her out. That's not good. <laughs> All right. Um, let's see. What else do we have today? We have more. We have more for you. We have more for you. Um, we also have, um, these wise life three pack of their reusable bags. Okay. Uh, these are great bags. Um, I love these. I've bought three packs of them. That means I have nine of them. Okay. We can use them in the back of our car, use them in my pantry. Um, I, I, and when I forget to like load my car with these bags and then I go to the grocery store and I don't have what I need, it drives me nuts. Um, because you know, trying to, put everything into the bag. And then it's just so much easier when you have something easy to like put all of your groceries in when you empty it out of the shopping cart. Um, I have a little video here that I'll show you. Um, here, Joe's setting them up here. You can see in the back of our car. So they expand really nicely. What's good about these is they have the long handles. So you can really carry them like low down. You don't have to lift it up. If it's really heavy, you can just kind of lift it from the long handles and lift them off the ground. Oh, he's bringing it to me. Thank you, Joe. Okay, so you can see one right here. Okay, this is what they look like. And then um, here's what it looks like when you fill it with some groceries too. Okay, so you can go ahead and Add all your groceries. What's nice is that they are um, water, like waterproof and water resistant. So you can just wipe them down. They're not, they've got like a coating on them. Okay. So that they're really easy to clean. Um, if anything leaks on them, any groceries leak or anything like that, it's really easy to do. Um, again, you can use these for multiple purposes. You can have it in the car. If that's what you're using it for, fold them down until you don't need them. When you need them, expand them out and you've got some nice big, um, you could see over there. I also have our, um, our Costco carriers too. When we go to Costco, that's another thing I got to find. I did. I got those on, on, on Amazon. I got to show this to you, but look, even breakfast cereals. Okay. Like if you want to, like, I have these lined inside my pantry on the floor in my pantry so that things that were just taking up a ton of room on the shelves, 
I could put low down underneath the shelves where there was like all this extra space that I don't want to put like food on the ground. Right. And I don't want to put it so that I have to like try to get it off the floor uh, behind itself. So these just kind of slide in when I have them in the car, I have the nice handle so that I can carry them nice and low. So I don't have to pick up the heavy ones too hard. But when I put them into the pantry, I can slide them in right next to each other. And I have a handle. So kind of, pulls out like a drawer from the floor and I got cereals in there. I've got, you know, tin foil and paper plates and things that like, you know, you just want to find a spot for them and you want to keep everything nice and organized. Um, these reusable boxes, these bins, I find them to be, they, they're some of the best I've had. They're good for like this type of a purpose. I have other bins that are more like cloth for other things, but for um, food and being on the floor, I really liked having these waterproof ones. All right, so $18, they're 38% off. This is a really good price too, as well on these bins. $38 and 69 cents for a three pack, okay? And they are large. So you're getting a lot of space with this. Three is gonna do it, okay? Like you can get, you get away with just having three of them, putting them in your car and you're gonna be able to carry your groceries in easily. You can use it for other things too. Like say you wanted to keep like a bunch of like, diapers and wipes and other things inside your car. This is a good way to organize your the trunk as well, just keeping those up. Um, very large capacity, okay. Um, let's see. What else do we have? We have a um, some extension cords, some plugs. We have um, a generator that's on deal today. We don't have this particular one, but this is the champion generator. Um, let's see, let me take a look at it here. Um, and we have the Duramax, but generators are, again, if you don't have a generator and you're interested in getting one, now's the time before there's a problem, okay? You don't want to wait until there is a need for a generator. You want to have that set up ahead of time, especially something like this where you're going to be hooking it to, you're going to need an electrician to come hook it up. But let me tell you, we waited for years to get our generator. Um, we just... I don't know. It was one of those things like if it's they're 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 an investment, you know, in time and money and everything else. And so we just kept putting it off because when you don't need it, it's like you don't think about it. Then when you need it, it's too late to get it at that moment. Either everyone else is getting it or it's just never going to be there in time. Um, but every time the lights would go out, every time we'd have storms, every time we'd be out of power, I'd be like, all right. We need to get the generator. And so I think it was about two years ago, we ended up going ahead and getting the generator. We got the Duramax and um, I'm so grateful. Like just in the few times that we've needed it to be able to like when the power's out, we haven't had like days with it out where we've had that in the past. Um, but you know, even like five, six hours, I don't feel as nervous about buy like we have an extra freezer and buying extra stuff for the freezer like i don't i feel like i'm saving money by buying more things in bulk and freezing them without the worry of like if the power goes out everything's gonna get destroyed right so um and you know and we work from home and it's just it's nice to have that peace of mind that no matter what's happening we can go outside and turn it on and the one that we got actually has the dual um the dual uh, fuel. So, and this one too has, uh, this one has, this is gas. So there's gas. There's also dual fuel. You can just look through these here and you can click through. Um, some of them have dual fuel where you're putting like um, gas in it, or they have natural gas hookup or they have propane. Um, and that's what we use. We have a big propane tank so that um, it just stays running no matter what's happening. And um, that felt very comfortable for us. We were we we lived through Hurricane Sandy over here a couple of years ago, and we were out of power for I think it was like two weeks. We had no power, but beyond just the power, the the, the gas trucks couldn't get through, so there was no gasoline. So even people with generators were struggling to even get gas for their generators. Um, so having something with the dual fuel just. Remember, this is like an emergency piece of equipment, and so giving yourself options is um, a really good really good idea. Okay. This is an electric start. Um, this particular one is, uh, 800 and I said under a thousand dollars. Um, it's got an 87, 8,750 watt, um, in, uh, motor here. And it's, um, you know, you, what you want to do is 
here's what I would recommend. If you're thinking about one, get an electrician to come out to your home and give you uh, an idea of what it is that you need to power up. So like, what are the essentials that you'd be wanting to power in your home if you do that? And then make sure that you can do it. You don't have to power everything, but there are certain things. Like if you live in the in the North and you wanna make sure that your furnace is going, you wanna make sure the lights can turn on, you wanna make sure that the refrigerators and the freezers, everything stays on. Um, you need to know, it depends on the size of your house. So you want to um, measure it against that. All right. Last thing I'm going to do here is this amazing portable car jumper cables. Another emergency piece of equipment that I think is an important piece to have too, um, in order to be able to, and this has got a nice deal on and also a coupon as well. They're 42% off right now. If you don't have this for your home um, or your home for your car, uh, or your kid's car, or, you know, it's just, it's a, it's a nice way to not feel stranded. <laughs> if you need to jumpstart your car, you don't need anyone to help you. Okay. These are normally a hundred dollars or $57 and 79 cents. And there was also a 25% coupon on this as well. So you're getting another additional 25% off on this. Trust me, if you are stuck where your car is like out of battery and you need to jumpstart your car, you're going to be so happy that you can do this yourself. OK, it's got a little LED light on it as well. Um, it's you know, these are these are the kind of jump starters that that even like triple A guys, they, they say that's what they're using now because they're just so convenient and easy to do. All right. You don't need anyone. You don't have to ask anybody. Um, you know, it's like having like your first aid kit, having your jumper cable in the car, having your um, tire inflator, like all the emergency things, having them in the car. So hopefully you don't need them. But if you do, um, you're not stranded. All right. And even like asking someone to like waiting for someone to come help you, um, you know, that could be a little scary too. Like you don't know who's around you. Right. You want to be able to take care of yourself. And this is a good way to do it. It's got... Um, like intelligent clamp features on it so that it's got like all the safety. I mean, if you're worried or if you're scared, you're like, I don't know, I never done this before. They're really easy to use and to learn how to use. Okay. So you want, and you obviously want to teach yourself how to do that before you need it. You keep meaning to add this to your car. Well, Kaylee, I would say tonight's a good night for that. <laughs> if you're going to get it, like get it at this price, right? What is this? 25% off of $58. I mean, that's a, that's a really nice discount there. Right. All right. What's 25% off of 58? It's around $10 or something like that, right? Something a little under $10. What is it? Turn on your sound. I can't hear you. Six, five? Four, one, one, fourteen dollars off. Okay, I can't do my math. Fourteen dollars off. So that's that's a really good price. I would get it right now. That that's that's diff, that's a better price than I've seen it at all, especially with that coupon. Don't forget the coupons, you guys. Don't ever forget the coupons here. All right. I think that's our carousel for tonight, you guys. I appreciate you all so much for joining me on this Friday evening to do some deals and just kind of hang out together. You know, it's good to be able to like just jump in and say hi to each other. I feel like I know all of you guys like seriously, it's just it's just awesome that you come in to say hi and that you come in to hang out and go over some pr different fun things. You know what I didn't get a chance to really look at while I was away, Kaylee? Um, our, our board of um, products and prizes that everybody posted on. I need to go do that. That was something that I didn't get a chance to see. Did you guys all post on there and show us the things that you want and things that you love and things that you're buying and shopping for and how it's helping in your life? Because I'm going to go check that out tonight. That was something I forgot. I've been wanting to go look at, at what you guys posted, but um, I know that you guys put a bunch of stuff up there. Um, let's see.
It was a nice surprise notification that you were going live tonight. Awesome, Melissa. Awesome. Where did you hear it? Did you hear it on the Amazon notification, on Facebook, on YouTube? I think we're streaming to all those channels right now, right? Um, that way you guys um, will know where when we are live and when we're on here, right? Yes, I think I did. <laughs> I think, which one? Facebook? You got it from Facebook? The app. Awesome. The app. Thank you for the follow, Amazon customer. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Katie said, yes. 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 Ah, oh, all right. So we're going to be back. We're going to take tomorrow off and then we'll be back. And I hope everyone has a wonderful Friday night, TGIF. And hi, Chris. Thanks for giving us your name. <laughs> Sometimes we, we see you as Amazon customer. I appreciate that. Hi. All right. Chris from Oklahoma. Fantastic. Welcome. Make sure you go register so you can win next time. Um, Alyssa was answering Kaylee from the community. <laughs> There's a delay. So sometimes I'm asking you questions and then you're not here. And then what happens is Kaylee can hear me in real time. So she's answering me before I even say it sometimes. So we laugh about that. Um, you're finishing up your sous vide steaks. Oh, I'm jealous. The sous vide steaks. Oh, I love my sous vide. They're good, right? I love my sous vide. Kaylee, do you have a sous vide? You don't have a sous vide? Oh my God. All right. Let's add that to the list. You need, you need a sous vide. You need a sous vide. Kaylee need, Kaylee's a chef. Did you know that? Kaylee's a chef. I need Kaylee to get a sous vide so she could teach me how to cook things in it. That's what I mean. Mm -hmm. You need one too, Brie? Mm -hmm. The sous vides are awesome. You don't even need to get a lot. You could just get the sous vide and use like a pot. Like it really works. And honestly, like that, that, um, sous vide style the what's it called the sous vide brand one it comes with the bags as well and it comes with the pump and i didn't know how to use the pump like i was struggling with it to figure out how to use it once i figure out how to use that manual pump i'm using that all the time they're like resealable bags with the manual pump and get the air out that quick i'm using it for things like just to get put stuff in the refrigerator and get the air out of them um it's really they're really really nice and then they sell them separately too next time i'll bring that on so i can show you what that looks like but those those sous vide bags and the sous vide and the sous vide machine um not the anova one the other one that we get they, we have two of them and the, and the bags that come with them they're really nice all right I'm going to say good night and we're going to let Kaylee go rest. Okay. And be with her family. And we're going to say good night to all of you guys. Thank you so much for joining me tonight. It was so fun to be with you guys. And um, we will see you again in a couple of days. All right. You guys have a safe and enjoyable weekend. And I love you all. Talk to you soon. Bye, everyone. See you.